we've talked about my board which is um, pretty much non-slip because it's MDF particle board I've sealed it so the surface is rough and when I cut my cutting technique means it doesn't move but what other options can we have in terms of cutting because not everyone can have a big board like this lo and behold I was at Bunnings looking for some well drainage pipe to put in a wicking bed and came across this in the door section of all places it's a um, smooth mat made out of neoprene 45 centimeters by 45 centimeters smooth mat. so this is portable you can put that away and then work on your tray or your table remember when um, i looked so at this glass the other day i said it had a warp in it so you can see <laughs> it's not flat at all so if anything's going to slip this will slip it's really really firm i'm going to cut this one i think i'm going to do some three quarter these are for my rainbow sun catcher when i get to it so i'm sort of cutting demoing and cutting bits off as i'll need them so getting your glass cutter where you need it to be so you can hold this or, or both of these together what suits you and your style of cutting Whoops. Okay, ready, set, go. You can see that going up and down. <laughs> so a bit of a challenge. And now I'm going to use those cute little new... Oh! Look what happens when the camera crashes in. That's never happened to me before. So I'm going to be doing something a little bit extra with this. That'll teach me for not having my tools out. Today's blooper. Little broom, get rid of these whiskers. So we'll move these over here. And back to cute little running pliers. The latest from uh, Lipanet. Um, what are they called? They're called RP7s. And uh, 19 Mosaic's got these in, so I've snaffled them up. Because they're a great little plier running plier and great for my hand size I think I showed them in a different video as well so we can just do a little crack there dead easy fantastic so I've got my three-quarter inch strip so we sweep away the crumbs because they can add to the slip and slide but also scratch your glass and we put because I think you can see it better if I'm cutting from this angle so the first cut is the width of the strip. So here, I'm just going to hold it here without worrying about holding these bits in place to see whether it in fact moves. So I think that, that didn't move at all. <laughs> I think that's a big thumbs up for uh, $6.30. Chop that off. And now I'll go back to here and do a couple of diamonds just to prove it. So if I'm doing three quarters, then the next one will be at one and a half inches. Because three quarters plus three quarters is 1.5. So a score here and a score at one, at one and a half. Back into one and a half. So getting it on the edge, pressing down and scoring. No movement at all. Actually, I think I'm going to be using this all the time now. A little break with the little baby pliers. And there I have my two perfect, perfect, perfect. So I will have all of those lovely diamonds to make a beautiful flower. That mat is awesome. 